Okay, today uh, I want to talk about something called homographs. Okay, homographs. What does this mean? Well, this is from Greek, original words from Greek. It's two parts. Homo means same, okay, and graphs, a graph, means writing, okay, so homographs means same writing, okay? Same writing. Okay, now, what is the definition of homograph? Okay, a homograph, or excuse me, homographs, are two words, okay, they have the same spelling, okay, so they look, they look the same when you see them in writing or on paper, but, and this is important, but they have different pronunciations and different meanings, okay, that's very important. Different pronunciations, different meanings, okay, but they look the same, okay. An example, right, this musical instrument, right, violin, piano, bass guitar, right, the pronunciation, bass, bass. My brother plays bass guitar. But also in English, there's a type of fish, okay, and the fish is called bass, 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 bass. Now, your question is probably, well, how do I know which pronunciation? Well, it's context. It's always the situation. For example, my brother is a musician. He plays bass, obviously. You wouldn't say he plays bass. He plays, he plays a fish? No, okay. Or last weekend, I went to the mountains. I went camping, and I went to the river, and I was fishing, and I caught a bass. I caught a bass in the river. I caught a bass in the river? No. I caught a bass in the river. Okay? Now, I'm going to make one more video about homographs, and I'll have 10 practice sentences for you to practice your pronunciation. It's a very good exercise to make sure you could do the two different, uh, pronounce the two different words properly. Okay? So check out the next video. Thanks.